Hello everyone and welcome to weather. The yellow level alert for hazardous seas is in effect until Saturday 2 p.m. So please exercise caution and monitor near shore and coastal sea conditions. And that's because occasional battering waves are likely, especially at high tides. So above normal tides in combination with north northeasterly long period swells will affect coastlines along northern and eastern Tobago as well as the northern, eastern and western coastal areas of Trinidad. And the atmosphere, meanwhile, will remain dry and hazy due to moderate concentrations of Saharan dust expected Thursday and Friday. And behind this plume of Saharan dust, however, a tropical wave 2,800 kilometers east of the Les Antilles heads westward and may arrive Saturday evening. And if so, it could mark the start of the 2023 wet season. Now, earlier today, Trinidad's maximum temperature was it was a warm 32.9 degrees Celsius and now at Port of Spain it's 30 degrees Celsius and following Tobago's high 30.2 degrees Celsius at Crown Point it is currently 29 degrees Celsius. So in the forecast for tonight both islands remain generally clear with the odd shower around with a low of 26 degrees Celsius expected in Tobago and in Trinidad expect a cool 23 degrees Celsius during a mainly clear night though with the isolated shower near hills. Now into Thursday, generally sunny, breezy and hazy conditions with a high at 30 degrees Celsius in Tobago. And in Trinidad, you can expect 33 degrees Celsius. That will feel like 36 degrees Celsius, factoring humidity due to the odd isolated shower. Now, looking ahead, there's no change through Friday as it remains hazy and breezy due to that Saharan dust. But by late Saturday, the approaching tropical wave may add moisture, increasing the likelihood of showers by Sunday morning. Looking offshore now, fisher folk can expect moderate seas near shore, however, may be occasionally choppy with battering, battering waves. Offshore waves up to 1.5 meters and below 1 meter in sheltered bays. Spring tides continue through Monday, so high tides will be higher than normal. At 3 a.m. and 3.44 p.m., low tides will be at 9.24 a.m. and 9.21 p.m. So for your recap, monitor those near shore sea conditions and exercise caution, especially during high tides. Back to you, Keisha.